Hello church, hope you're having a good day. We've been having a great day here, it's very busy. Here on Tuesdays we have Springers, as you can see, which is quite a lively uh, morning with mums and tots doing all sorts of wonderful things and activities. You can hear them going in the background as we speak now. And they have a wonderful time together. And here in the kitchen uh, you have Enid and Nikki from across the road who come and serve faithfully all, each week for Springers. And uh, as you can see, the ladies are doing a great job. Ladies, give us a wave. Come on, there we go, that's it, yeah, lovely, thank you. <laughs> also this week, Alpha is gonna be happening, and again, it starts up this week, but if you've got someone who you wanna bring along, then it's still never too late, it doesn't matter what week, if you have somebody who's interested in knowing a little bit more about Jesus, you can bring them along. You know, on Sunday we talked about fasting and praying and in Mark 11 it says whatever things you ask when you pray, believe that you receive them and you will have them. You know, we need to believe and that's what God's asking us to do this, to pray and to believe. You know, there's a reason Paul talks about labouring in prayer, that's in Colossians. When we pray, we must be passionate, persistent and positive expecting good things from God. We've got to put our hearts into all our prayers and believe God will do what he's promised. I like what Bob Gass says in the UCB notes. He says, the only currency God trades in is faith. And faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word. You know, another thing that Bob Gass said in his notes this week, which I really liked, talking about a town, an area where there was a real drought and everybody got together to pray. And at the church, everything was full, but there was one little girl at the front. And she was sat there all beaming and smiling. She had a red umbrella right next to her. And right at the end, he says this, um, look, the congregation, he announced, the rest of us came to pray for rain, but she came expecting God to answer. So. Don't just pray, believe. Let's believe what God can do this year.